Maritzi family's home is perched a thousand meters above the Etch Valley in South Tyrol. A modern landmark made of stone, it sits on a steep slope overlooking a small mountain village. The building is modeled on a fortified tower in the style of a medieval castle. The house, accessible only by bridge, is a favorite gathering place for the family. The owner's daughter, Simona Rizzi, spends most of her weekends here. Hi, and welcome to our castle. We get to the house by crossing the bridge, just like in a real castle. And we come straight into the highest level of the building. An atrium connects the upper levels of the 22-meter tower. A spiral staircase leads up to the roof. The stairs lead up to the roof terrace, the highest point of the house. Our living rooms, kitchen and bedrooms are all downstairs. Here you can see how the house was built sloping downward. The living room with its fireplace, dining room and kitchen surround the atrium to form an open living area. Three generations of the Rizzi family get together here every weekend. They call this part of the four-story building the Piano Nobile, or noble floor. Its rather spartan furnishings work to the advantage of the round structure. This includes the open front face with the curved panorama terrace. There's a view of the Upper Etch Valley and the Finchgau Valley up to the Swiss Alps. The Rizzis run an international food market in the valley town of Lach. The house is designed so that the front is all glass, giving us a beautiful view of the Finchgau Valley from every room. We get sunlight in the rooms all through the day, and of course we use the terrace. When the weather's good, we're outdoors as much as possible. The tower was created from stone, glass and steel by Werner Scholl, an architect from South Tyrol. Simona's father, Walter Rizzi, had a plot of land and a dream. After seven years, in 1999, the tower was finished. With 500 square meters of living space on four levels, there's room for the entire Rizzi family. In the upper levels, there are more bedrooms and children's rooms. And there's the office, with one of the first design models of the Villa Rizzi. The chestnut furniture was made to measure and fits into the curved walls. The Rizzis also wanted a modern version of a traditional South Tyrolean parlor. We use it like a real traditional parlor. We sit here together in the evenings after dinner and play cards while the children sometimes sleep here. Or sometimes we just read a book. The lowest level of the tower is partly built into the mountain. It's a wellness area with a view of the Alps and a swimming pool built entirely of stone. Just like in a mountain grotto. We chose a blue shade here, which mirrors the water and the concrete of the pool, so that it looks like a mountain lake. And we've also left the window area open, so that you get the feeling you're outdoors. With the push of a button, there's also a waterfall, almost like in a real grotto. Simona Rizzi loves the view most of all. At more than a thousand meters high, a stormy wind often blows, but the sun shines longer up there than in the valley. A day in the tower is like meditation for Simona Rizzi. Up here in the solitude, she says she can find inner peace. <laughs>